See, there are two reasons why NGOs should not or cannot, not should not, cannot invest in gold. The first reason is that NGOs have got a tax exempt status from the government, from the income tax department. Now, while I mean this of course, we look at uh, today in the afternoon and in the income tax uh, session, but while giving the tax exempt status, the government has put certain conditions, right? Basically three conditions. First condition that you cannot accumulate grants or funds. You have to spend it for the purpose for which the funds have come, right? So, they say at least 85 percent you have to spend during the year, first condition. Hmm? Second condition, the unutilized funds have to be invested in specified investments outlined under section 11 <coughs> subsection 5 of the income tax act which excludes gold which excludes bombay stock exchange right which one <coughs> the second one so the second point is that NGOs cannot invest in, uh, NGOs can invest in certain specified securities which are specified in the Income Tax Act, which does not include gold, <coughs> which does not include direct uh, share market, for example, right. The third is that NGOs cannot use the funds for, uh, for the benefit of the board members, of the board members or the founders or the board members of the organization. It's, this is section 13. <coughs> section, section 12, you get the exemption. Section 11 puts conditions on, on spending and investment. Section 13 talks about related parties and interested party transactions. Right. So, this we will discuss much more in detail when we come to the Income Tax Act. But here, therefore, the this NGO would not be allowed to invest in uh, gold. <coughs> Secondly, speculative investment out of foreign funds is also prohibited in the FCRA law. For example, FC, if you have foreign in funds, FCRA funds, you are not allowed to invest it even in mutual funds, which are some of the mutual funds, debt linked mutual funds are allowed within section 11.5 of the Income Tax Act. So, even though the Income Tax Act allows it, FCRA law does not allow investment of funds, foreign funds in the mutual funds or um, speculative investments. So, these are the issue about the legal point about the investment. 